Do you have a problem with the offload app option not showing on iPad and iPhone? Hello friends, I am Jay. I will show you four different ways to fix the issue. The offload app feature is available only on iOS 11 or later. Make sure your iPhone or iPad device is running on iOS and iPad OS 11 or later. To check the iOS version, launch the settings app and tap on general. Then, tap on about and check the iOS version. That's it. Let's look at the first way to find an offload app option in storage management settings. Launch the settings app on your iPhone. Then, swipe up and tap on the general section. After that, tap on iPhone storage. Swipe up and check if the option to offload unused apps is available. This option is only visible under recommendations for optimizing storage and may not appear on new iPhone or iPad devices. To forcefully turn on offload apps, follow the alternate way to find it under App Store settings. Let's see the steps. Launch the settings app and swipe up until you see the App Store section. Tap on it. Now, swipe up and find the Offload Unused Apps option. This method applies to your device for all apps, but offload specific apps, follow the next method. The third way is to offload specific apps from the Settings app. Launch the Settings app on your iPhone. Swipe up and tap on General. Then, Tap on iPhone Storage. Swipe up and select the specific app you want to offload. Tap on the Offload app. If missing in your case, then check Screen Time Restrictions. Launch the Settings app on your phone or iPad. Then, swipe up and tap on Screen Time. Now, swipe up and tap on Content and Privacy Restrictions under the Restrictions section. Then, Turn off the toggle beside content and privacy restrictions to temporarily disable screen time. To check restrictions, launch the settings app. Swipe up and tap on screen time. Then, tap on content and privacy restrictions and select iTunes and App Store purchases. Now, enter the screen time passcode if enabled. Tap on deleting apps and select allow option. Go back to the storage management settings and check if the offload app option is available. A pop-up may appear saying that offloading the app will delete it but keep its documents and data. Tap on the offload app to confirm. That's it. To reinstall the app in the future, launch the app store and find the app in the search bar. Type the app name and tap the cloud icon. Reinstalling the app will restore all the data and documents that are still present on your iPhone. That's it. I hope you find this video helpful. Don't miss to like, share and subscribe for more upcoming video. Also comment for more help.